So here's the deal. Sarah planned the entire anniversary trip, which is great. I'm sure it'll be fantastic. But the kicker is, I have no idea where we're going. You're driving for the first half an hour. You have no idea where we're going. And then you drive the rest of the way. Yes. So the plan is, she'll let me drive for 30 minutes. And after that, she'll take over and we'll have total control over the rest of the trip. Now that's great and all, but it's a little uneasy when your navigator gets lost. So ladies and gentlemen, we're actually at the point where we're now just wasting gas. And Sarah's oh just driving. It's literally right back there. So we've done this loop twice now. Hey, you are a big old man black in my view. I need to get back behind the driver's seat. Seriously, if you don't, we need to get back. We need to go back. Oh, where are we going? I don't, I don't know, know but I know. You said you know where we're going. Where's where your guest? I don't care anymore. <laughs> is this where we're staying? <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Here we go. <laughs> All right, here we're at, we're at the place now, and we made it to our destination. A quaint little cottage, cozy, warm, and perfect for a two-night stay. on our way down to the beach and it looks beautiful you can hear the sounds it's still open in the middle of winter and it's still open so I'm walking down to it now Man, can you guys hear that I can't put my finger on it, but being out in nature just gives you a reset button. Even 15 minutes on a cold beach can help clear your mind and give you perspective. Okay, Sarah, what would you say are the top three areas of, of improvement I go, for us? I go. That we've made or that we need? That we need. Ooh. Communication. Understanding. Okay. Can you on Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, communication, probably patience. Maybe a little bit of grace for each other, a little bit more. I think more is required the longer we're together. Thank you so much. Are we ready to order? Uh, steak salad. Yeah. Yeah, I want to do the steak yeah. feature. Mm. It's a double-edged sword right there with my number one pick, and that's your mind. Not my body. <laughs> Not my body. I feel like that's a good thing though, because one, it's changed a lot. No comment. There's more mandala. <laughs> I'm stopping this now. <laughs> Unity when it comes to uh, parenting the kids. I think we started off well and we, and we got even better. We may not share the same views all the time, but we do respect each other's perspective. We both have growth mindsets. That's a really good one. Patience, collaboration together, trying new things together. I like to do more new adventures with you. Lovely evening and delicious dinner, but the strawberry sauce was not my jam. Not my jam at all. Shortly after dinner, the weather took a huge turn for the next 48 hours. So little did I know, we've got a big, we've got a big snow front coming our way. This is not uncommon, but just didn't see it on the radar. At this point in time, I thought the trip was over, 
and we needed to head home. But Sarah had one more thing planned, and that honestly was the best part of this entire getaway. It's a tiny home. Milk. I can relate. Super narrow up here, but it is super cool. And for the final day, we didn't go anywhere. We didn't do anything special. We just stayed in this tiny home and enjoyed each other. It just goes to show you that it really is all about the little things. Sarah's out there with the baby. We might switch later on, but I need to sleep in the bed. She's sleeping on the couch. Oh my gosh, you're killing me. What? You don't know the words. <laughs> That's a word.